All right. We ain't playing around. We ain't playing a round. We're playing five rounds. Aren't I witty? I guess it takes all the way to the end of the week for me to actually uh, finally get the brain working. And then it kind of just dies until next Friday. It's it's a roller coaster, and by roller coaster, it's just got one hill. And that hill is today. Today being Friday. We're going to get down on a Friday. Because everyone is looking forward to the weekend. Fuck, when did that come out? 2006? No, that would have been like 2010. What am I doing? Anyway. We again, for this Friday, were uh, thankfully blessed by the lemons themselves with another map to do. And we're going to do it now. It's called Random European Locations. Just how random and just how European are these locations, we're going to find out. But right now, I see a sign that's blocking up the scenery. Not so much breaking my mind. Oh, uh, it's just not clear enough. See, this looks like it's, uh... Hmm. It's Bonka? Oh, uh, this... Oh, what do we got? Auto Aptica. All right. Let's, uh, continue on our way here. As, uh... Yeah, this looks like it's, uh... Maybe either there or there. I don't know why my brain compartmentalizes such places like these cars make it look like it's more very Eastern European than it is uh, Turkish, but we uh, continue on. Is this nice little idyllic place? Is this a, uh, I'm going to say this is an arcade. I don't care what it is. This is like arcade signage. That's what it looks like to me. Or an audio store like an audio file store you can buy uh jail auto audio if that's even a thing anymore get some kickers um i'm trying to think of other <laughs> other um like speaker companies back when i cared about having a sound system in my car however shitty my car was <laughs> jail auto get kickers kenwood What's down here? Like, uh, can we can we go down here? Yes, we can. I see an auto store potentially. Big uh, Cook Gala. Hmm. These are just teasing me right now. Ooh, there is some stuff right here. What do we got? So you got. I keep. Why do they keep putting Peugeot stuff here? But it's not that. This is. Ah, uh, this has got to be Turkey. It can't be turkey. Why why can't I this this is this one's this is a good one. It's it's very much blowing my mind here. I'm hoping I'm gonna go home on this and go the other way. Because maybe this way will uh tell me. I'm really annoyed that I thought I had it the first ten seconds when I turned around and saw that URL and I was hoping that I was actually gonna get La Latvia. So this, why, this makes me feel like it's Latvia. Berna. Let's see. We've got. I'm gonna say we're in Riga. Although this could be like anything outside. I'm sticking with Latvia. I'm feeling. I'm feeling confident in that. That's a very bread building. This is an interesting, like layout for this assuming that this is that city where it's kind of like okay we got apartment block apartment block and then random smatterings of tennis last time i checked it's not how you spell tennis oh fuck ninja turtles i need to see this all right what's what here um those are ninja turtles that's bambi that's a car. I don't know what the fuck the name of the car is. Don't I have no idea what that is. Is that like a dog? With a vest on? 
I don't I and I don't know. I got these two. It's like I watched this as a kid. I watched that as a kid. Oh, we were I did get the country right eventually. Only thing I know about the car was Owen Wilson voiced it. And I don't know what the fuck that other thing was. So it was just a weird smattering of uh cartoon things there. Hello, tracksuit. This feels Mediterranean. We're going to go from there. Like, we got the, the titty bar here. <laughs> oh, wait, where'd that sign go? Here we go. All right. That looks like the Portuguinian um, sign there. It's probably not. E Puesta en Valor del Barrio de San Sebastian. And they're saying this is how much it cost. Um, it's a lot of euros. You've got Ayuntamiento de Don Benito. Nailed it. What do we got? What do we got? Nothing there. I'm slowly running into this issue again. I had this probably a year ago at this point where I had the uh, computer fan issue where it got super loud and like not the good type of loud. It was like this thing sounds like it's going to fall apart and it's come back again. Like I, I, I thought I air quote fixed it. Okay. Meh. We're, we're, Don, Don Benito. The fuck is Don Benito? Don Benito. This is like, I feel we're, we're in Portugal. I'm going to put us there. But again, could be Italy. Because you have these palm trees here and the sun makes me, makes me not think that this is. Uh, one sec. I'm going to cough. Okay, we're recording. Um, yeah, there's a lot of palm tree here, so now I'm not thinking it is. What do we got? Extremena camisetas. Yes, yeah, we're in Spain. Okay. I'm going to say Valencia. Or actually, no. Um, what was the name of that place again? It's going to take me a long time to get there. I feel like maybe this is one of the islands off of España here. It was San, San Bonito. I don't, I, I don't know, but there are signs here. Here we go. We've got, I think that's a, uh, um, Grocery store. Centro Abierto. Las Cruces. I've heard of Las Cruces. <laughs> Maybe in the front of this roundabout it'll tell me. So keep looking at signs. We got, I'm going to assume that's Jesus on a rock, even though I'm, we, we do have big sign. Big sign here. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Madrid's that way. Okay. We're, we're, uh, take a look here. We've got, uh, EXA2. Oh, I ran out of time. It was the name of it. Don Benito. What if they sell those Benito things there? No, Burritos. They're like, um, the fuck is this? Someone's got a Stargate in the top of their building? What happened to it? It's in a little disrepair. I forget what um uh burritos, burritos, whatever they're called. It's like tortilla chips, but they're something with bears. Well, we have at least a region. So we're gonna put ourselves here. 
now figuring out exactly where where the Fargate is. It's it's legally dis distinct. Fargate has nothing to do with the other movie. And it's been so long since I've watched that show. I have all the DVDs for it, but I don't even think I have a way of playing it. Like, I'm, I think if I reconnect, well, actually, I do have my PS3 hooked up. But that is, like, the only thing I have. That is a dusty car. Other than that one. I don't have a uh, Blu-ray player other than that. These are a little sun-baked. Hmm. So now I'm going to look for any letters that don't look Russian. That kind of doesn't, but that's a Russian letter. All right. They do get a lot of sun here. It's a little dry. So maybe down here, I'm going to say, maybe around Rostov on Don. Probably not. Um, man, I had a train of thought that I was going to go on here, and now I don't remember what it was. Very important. Not losing your memory. Like I apparently am. Okay, that looked like a very dry chunk, and now it's not anymore. We've reached the end of the uh, town here. I wonder what this was. Or was this always a shed? I don't know. But this is a very nice building here. But there are wall mounted AC units. Yeah, look, it, it, that's a quick jump from. Uh, so now maybe it's not. Maybe it's not there anymore. Okay, so we do have. So this almost makes me think this could be um, Bulgaria because they do the same thing, but there's also a different language there. And Bulgarians like using uh, Cyrillic, at least on their lettering. And there's a second one there. So I feel that this is actually uh, Bulgaria and not Russia. And I feel, if I nail this, I'm going to feel so smart for the Fargate. Oh, yeah. Aqua Teen Hunger Force in my, in my DVD player, my Blu-ray player that I have. Whoa, they fenced off a whole street here. I wonder why. Hmm. But, yeah, I think I actually still have, back when no one really knew at the time, after DVDs came out, they were going to come up with their next, uh, that says hotel. Their next, uh, like, media format. And this is a very bright and hot location here. And this is hopping. Look at this. Now I don't think this is Bulgaria. Oh, shit, it was. <laughs> Got it. Nice. It's a cool place. Um, yeah, there was, there was a big, um, like contest between Blu-rays and HD DVDs. And uh, basically how it works out with the same thing with VHS and uh, Betamax as far as like um, media storage and whatever you want to call them. That whatever porn goes is what media format wins. Even though I think argument, you could make the argument, and I think it's actually true that Betamax was a better format than uh, than VHS cassettes, but porn went with VHS, so that's what won out. Same thing happening with uh, uh, Blu-rays and HD DVDs. Porn went Blu-rays, so HD DVDs won out. And I actually own a uh, HD DVD player. I don't think it actually has any HD DVDs, like Evo. The former guy on this channel has HD DVDs. Has a couple of them. Like, I think Iron Man, maybe one of the Hulks. I forget which one. And, like, I got it for Christmas. I think it's still in one of my storage bins. And it had a uh, gift that said, Here, get 10 free HD DVDs. And even at the time I got it, I already knew that 
Blu-ray one out, and I should have just been like, yeah, maybe I'll do this, but I never did. And I think I still have the... Ooh, we do have a uh, URL on the side of this fan. That we blew right by. .nl, okay. We have ourselves. 100% chicken. I'm going to say 8% halal, so you're kind of kind of be screwed going into that one. So we've got NL, huh? I had to pick a place. Amherst Foot, even though it says Amherst Fort. I'm going to say that's where we are, even though that's probably not true. I'm going to say outside Amsterdam. Anyway, it took ambling of I don't know how long. Well, four rounds. To uh, ask how your week's been. Well. We went to a very rainy day very quickly. It's been pretty much the same the last couple of weeks. I forget when I actually started um, working from home. I think it was a month and there were a week. So maybe six weeks ago at this point. I've been working at home. Man, that, no, it's got to be five. Uh, maybe, I don't know. And I'm not entirely sure how much longer I'll be working at home. Could be... Another month. I think my state has a uh, stay-at-home order, at least until I think it's beginning of May, or it was May 14th or something. I forget exactly what. Ooh, we do have... Mm, excuse me, my throat's starting to go. I have nothing to drink, so I'm going to hopefully not get too parched while uh, doing this. All right, let's get out into the road here. Well, it's gone now. I guess they fixed construction. Oh, they put a tram line in. That's cool. I'm going to assume that that's new. We have a watch. Watch, I mean clock. And that looks like an awesome sl uh, sled slide. Look at that fucking thing. Hopefully the sun doesn't, um, I'm sure it does, just bake that tube. The second you go in there, oh, you just burn your thighs so bad. Put your head in that in the summer, just be an oven. Oh, God. You'd have to do it at least once. It was 50-50 which one I was going to go with, and I chose the wrong one. And finally, we're uh, preventing these nice gentlemen from... Oh, actually, I almost thought this was a dead end, and they're blocking us in, and they were going to rob us. What do we got under the uh, sun bleached? Nice. They put cardboard over the uh, tires there. Either to keep them from rusting out or something else. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, I can't, you can't escape it. Just because one person writes it doesn't mean everyone thinks it. It's just that one person had it. And even with them writing it doesn't mean they uh, very much believe in it either. Okay, so we have... The same type of language we potentially had in the first one. I am flying all over the place. How did I end up here? Give me back. Give me. Okay, fine. We're we're sticking on here. We're gonna we're gonna make it out. Back to this road here. Also, printing and advertising. Well, they do English here. At least that sign does. And that doesn't mean anything. I did see the stop sign. What fruit is this? I don't know. Two minutes left. What am I feeling? I can't I can't really tell just yet. They sell cigarette camels very much on the side of this side of the road here. Like if I saw a cross up on wait a minute. No, this is definitely not Ma This can't be Macedonia. They park on the sidewalks like Macedonians. What's this? What's this street sign say? Let me. No, I guess I can't. All right, fine. Like I saw that top of the hill there, and I said if there was a giant cross on the top of that, I would say that this is Macedonia. But I'm not getting that just yet. Come on. Lacarne plus SI. God, what was SI? 
Is that Slovakia? Slovenia. I'm going to say it's Slovenia. And we're in a Ljubljana. What else could it be besides S? Slovakia is SL, so Slovenia is... I don't know if I would pick SI for Slovenia. If I had to choose a second letter to represent Slovenia, maybe O? SO? I don't know. Pituge? Yeah, Pituge, I feel. There's Pituge. Are we in Pituge? No. But we're close. That's where the truck is from, but I don't think the truck. I'm still. Hmm, no, I'm going to stick with Patouge. I'm feeling. I'm feeling. No. Ah. Uh, how, how developed is Patouge? Ah. Uh, man. Do I see a mountain anywhere? What about Ljubljana? Is there like any. It is a bit mountainous. Um. Heads or tails? I'm going to do this really quick. Um, heads is Lubjana. It's, I picked tail, so we're sticking with Patouge. Hopefully my quarter didn't. Okay. So we were closer at least. So I'm okay with that coin toss. Thank you, coin, for pulling us out. This was a fun one. This video flew by super fast. And I'm, again, checking to see if it actually is recording and not muted and both happened so congratulations to me i was able to do the basic basic steps of recording a video for you guys and once again i'd like to thank you all for watching and congratulate you for getting through your week you made it um i'd like to thank lemons again for the map that he that they graciously gave us to do for this friday if you like them have a map suggestion for me could be one you made yourself or one you've seen could be any country you have, any theme, anything at all, go ahead and put them in the comments below. I will read them and get back to you, along with all the other comments, questions, concerns, complaints, hints, tricks, reminiscences, suggestions for other games, whatever you want. Go ahead and put them down there. I will read them and get back to you. Just like I will for Monday when we continue with more geoguessing. So until then, have a great weekend, folks. You're going to make it. I will too. We'll see you then. Goodbye.